Tourism is the number one industry in the Florida Keys. Visitors come for fishing, diving, sailing, and the laid-back lifestyle that permeates the Keys. Many who come to visit end up living here year-round. The influx of people and burgeoning economy has come at a price for the Keys. In the 1980s, it was discovered that pollution, largely from wastewater, had reached dangerous levels. The magnificent coral reefs and marine life, which are the foundation of the region's tourism industry, were not okay. At the heart of the problem were thousands of ineffective septic systems and cesspools across the islands. Most of the islands sit atop a layer of coral rock that does little to remove the pollutants in the wastewater, allowing it to seep into the groundwater and eventually into the canals and oceans surrounding the islands. Residents as well as local and state officials began to realize that a great natural resource was dying unless they addressed their need for proper wastewater management. The Florida Keys encompasses a large geographic area, approximately 137 square miles, covering 1,700 islands, of which 35 are considered major islands. More than 80,000 people live year-round in the Keys, and an estimated 4 million tourists visit the islands each year. Providing sewer service to such a large area and involving several entities presented a sizable challenge for project planners. After conducting a significant amount of research, initial projects were constructed using the AirVac vacuum sewer system. Chuck Fishburne, general manager of the Key Largo Wastewater Treatment District, had this to say. The circumstances we face here in the Keys led us to select vacuum sewer technology. After completion of a test project, we saw how the system worked and we were very pleased with the outcome. Based on the test project, we decided to utilize vacuum sewers wherever we could. The geography of the Keys presents several significant challenges that would have made a sewer construction project extremely difficult and prohibitively expensive. Don Eckler, president of Eckler Engineering said, in the Keys you have flat terrain, high groundwater, developed neighborhoods, and very difficult soil conditions. All of these create problems when designing and installing sewers. Vacuum sewer technology solved many of the problems that are inherent in the Keys. The shallower trenches associated with vacuum mains helped avoid many of the cost and labor issues that deep trenching would have required, and dewatering was minimized. There was less disruption to the established neighborhoods, and because the vacuum mains used smaller diameter PVC pipe, the installers could use less and smaller equipment. The design engineers and installation crews also received the benefit of AirVac's years of vacuum sewer experience. George Font, Vice President of GlobeTech Construction commented, there are always a lot of unknowns in an underground construction project. It was extremely helpful to have AirVac there to make recommendations during the field installation process. They have always been great to help come up with workable solutions. Ease of installation and the resulting cost savings were significant factors in choosing vacuum technology for the key sewer system. But there were numerous other benefits that made vacuum sewers a perfect fit for the keys. Vacuum sewers are less vulnerable to electrical power loss. No electricity is needed to operate the individual vacuum valves, and each vacuum station is equipped with a backup generator. The result is no loss of sanitary sewer service, even if the power is lost. Also, because vacuum sewers are a closed system, there is no infiltration or exfiltration. While extremely rare, if a leak were to occur, it would not result in sewage spills, but rather air would enter the pipe and be immediately detected. In designing the system, Engineers came up with innovative ideas that paid some immediate benefits and will help utility workers for years to come. Because vacuum collection lines are watertight, they were laid in the same trench with stormwater collection lines and reuse water lines, saving installation time and valuable space. Furthermore, during the daily inspection of the vacuum main installation, the inspectors marked coordinates with a GPS device to create a detailed map of buried infrastructure. Of course, the most important objective of the Massive Keys project 
is a cleaner aquatic environment in and around the islands. The initial projects using AirVax technology have begun to make a difference. But the task is not yet completed. When all of the communities throughout the Keys complete their sewer collection and treatment systems, cleaner water will be a reality, and the lifestyle that defines the Keys will be preserved. In 2009, the city of Marathon, Florida received the Pisces Award from the Environmental Protection Agency for projects that represent a commitment to the state's aim to achieve sustainable water quality. Marathon's design won the award in part because of the innovative one trench design for installation, which was made possible because they chose to install a vacuum sewer system by AirVac, the world leader in vacuum sewer technology.